85. Look at that cowboy thing, that's pretty cool. Big bull thing that says long horns on them. They go on the other side, we used to see gap. We're on proper old Route 66 and there's a cockerel. Yes, so we're on the proper Route 66, like old, the most intact part of it. And we're going to go to the Midway Calf, it's also the midway point of the route. Is it? Yeah. There's an original restaurant that got ruined by the interstate. There you go. So the interstate's there. And this is the original route. Another abandoned house, big abandoned thing. So the interstate's only a couple of metres away, but no one ever drove down it. So business went out the window. And you can't exactly, if you see it, you can't exactly turn round on the interstate. So. Chambre. So there is some um, original Route 66. Like the most intact part, still, on that part. But like, this isn't a service road, like the other ones look like 66, but it's actually built over by the interstate. This one is still living. And there's the interstate right there. There's a bumpy cloud. Look, if you can't see it, I, I, Mouth. And then, like this is all the head. We are passing the midpoint thing. Look there. We have passed halfway, I think. Adrian. So this is Adrian. Where did all the traffic come from? An abandoned side? place. There's one of those really cool Texas things. So we're going to the midpoint cafe. Which is there? The Midpoint Calf. There is the Midpoint Calf sign. Here is the calf itself. And there is the Midway actual sign there. We'll get a better look in a second. An American flag. And look, here's all the um, little, what do you call them? Um, little state signs of the 66. Another roadside attraction there. Um, Texas, there is the line, but um, I'm just going to go and eat now. So we're in it and it's like a proper cool American diner. So we've got all this stuff up here. That's the most stuff all on the walls, like number plates of all their places. Route 66 beers. We need to get one of those. There's a Route 66 sign. Lots more number plates up there. Gas station, like with gumballs in it. Lots of postcards and things and, and magnets. Oh, tin signs, I'm gonna get myself one of those. There's some nice pictures up there. And it looks really nice. Look historic. So I ordered hot dog and chips, and I got hot dog and crisps. Yeah, I knew, it. but the crisps are so nice. These and this. So we're sitting between the midpoint, kind of. The midpoint's not actually where the sign is. Like the sign's there, but the midpoint is actually like here on the floor. So I'll show you that after dinner. Harley Davidson Road. How the pack originally looked. Interior. So how it a bit more updated now. That's the sign. And we've got a gas station, which is next door. The place is the inspiration for Flo's caffeine cars, you know. Yeah, that's the inspiration for that. And there's a jukebox there. And Alex. And there's um, look, it actually says Root 66 beer, like Root beer. Yeah, get it? Yeah, haha. <laughs> And we've got like a little collage, dinosaur. And then we're 
we're going to have a look in the gift shop now. So we've just come out of the calf. It's a really nice calf. Got loads of merchandise. So it is the midpoint calf. Now we're going to sign this car. Mia. This should be in Shamrock. Look at all this writing. Where should we write it? Perhaps these silver pens, they're white. But if you've got one, yeah. Go on, quickly, so we don't do it. I'm trying to find that's all right. That's all right. So Ollie's going to sign it. Here, little Ollie. This seems. You need to do a little one. Just a little. Only little. Just little. Ollie. Uh, Ollie. Just quick then. Right. Um, I'm going to do it here. What? I can't see you. It. Yeah, people have got inside of it and written on it. How? I don't know. Like, hello! Oh, oh, this. Eyes. It's a Ford. Pretty cool track. It's got so much writing on it. Yeah, so I signed it. It's pretty cool. Look, that's my dad's David Howard. Alex, me. Look at this old calf sign. It's crazy. It's just so old everywhere. Look at that fabulous motel. Look how old that is. So we we'll just sign this, and then we're gonna go to Tamakari. This is the inside of it. It's pretty cool. Can you get in? This is a bit of like this gas station that was in the pictures earlier. And then I realised I haven't actually filmed the midpoint, so Alex, do you want to come with me? Yeah. So, we're just, this is the midpoint. It's got Route 66 there. And this is the midpoint. So, this, that, this is exactly 100 and... and 1,339 here. So this side is like point one. This side is point one that way. So that's Sh that way Chicago. That way's LA. So this is the exact middle point. And then it's got Route 66 on here. There we go. And then that's the cafe we just in. So they're really nice. They're really good. But look, we're just standing in the middle of the road, and there's not one car. Look. Okay, there's the odd car. No, what is the population? Like, it's like 150. Yeah, like 150. But look, we're just standing in the middle of the road. Don't even have to worry. I don't have to worry. I can, I can look, just slide here. Oh, they should do this. They should do a race. Yeah, like that's Chicago. Race, like to each end. Yeah. No, so, they should do one goes to Los Angeles, one goes to Chicago. Yeah, so miles down that way. Miles down that way. Look, look it's a car. What? Over there. Oh my god, it's a car. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, but it's just miles and miles of empty road because of that interstate. That interstate made all this place bankrupt. Look, that's why it's. Oh, they don't have the money to do up the sign. But luckily, the tourists pay for it. Well, the odd tourists every couple of hours. This place is luckily still running due to tourists. Everywhere's running because of tourists around here. And we've got... Quite sad. Yeah, it's... Slightly busy. There's like a couple of cars. There's like a car coming. Well, the calf's just closed. So, oh no, he passed. Yeah, yeah there's uh, old bikes. It's all like old style, original. And in there, the menu hasn't changed since it opened. And there's a dog in there. Should we go in there? Yeah, yeah. Hello, doggy. Hi, wife. Hello, puppy. How are you? 
Yeah, so, you think so it's a little shop. Yeah. Pretty cool. Yeah, so what I was saying is in there, the menu is the original menu from when it opened. They haven't changed it at all. Enjoying this dog. Look at all this. This is a pretty cool little magnets. Some Texas number plates. Where do you spend the night tonight? We're going to the beach. Oh, wonderful. Great. Right. And we're supposed to have a, a rainstorm tonight. So, you know, if you're at the beach, Selfie sticks. Whoa, look at that. That's nice. So this is cool. Oh, that's sick. 20. Neon, it says. Every single day. There's <laughs> more in here. Oh, it's one of those traditional, like, American, like, trolley things. Oh, my God, look at that man cave. What does it say? No sitting in my chair, hands off the remote. Women by invitation only, bringing food is strongly suggested. Oh, that's sick. I'm going to get that. That's cool. Got lots of cars, things. Outbreak. Whoa, look at that dude. <laughs> Got some signed things by it looks like the Hells Angels or something. But it looks so nice in here. It's cool. I think we should buy I'm, I'm definitely gonna buy something. Don't know what. I'll buy that thing. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna get that man cave thing. It's a great Oh, hello, doggy. So this is the owner's. This is the owner of the gift shop, aren't you? You're the owner. Everyone loves him. He's a good lad. Say hello. What's his name? Brody. Hello. Say hello to Brody. Hello. 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 <laughs> April and she was playing out back yeah. with Brody and she came in and she tugged my sweater. Oh, he's beautiful. <laughs> Sandy bag. Oh, <laughs> but she came back in and she said, I teach him preach. <laughs> really? <laughs> well, he's watching her all the time and she folded her little arms and she said, a seat. Well, it's so similar to sit. Yeah. Yeah. He sat right down. And she looked at me and she said, See, yeah. I teach him oh. French. He's very clever. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. 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 He'll be eight in December. He's a good age. Oh, I'm screwed. He's too old. 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 Are you sad of me then? I know, I know. It's got, so sad. They got dogs on the bed. So we've just left the Midway Point. That was probably my favourite part so far because they were all just so friendly and it was really nice. But now we're coming up to. So that was the Midway of Route 66 and now we're going to the state border from Texas to New Mexico. Look at that. Looks like it's the sea, but it's not. We're in the middle of the land. Six. It might just end and we'll have to turn back. Or it's going to force us onto the interstate. Oh, it just ends. <laughs> but it's just... It got paved over by the interstate. Cause... Oh. So what happened is, like, so it was coming along here. And then it winded over that way, onto that way, but obviously the interstate paved straight for it, so it just cut it off. People have just driven across. Anyway. We're stuck at the end of an old part of Route 66. So we're going to have to head back instead of go across the dirt, because we're not rebellions. 